loves welcome back to my channel it's your girl amanda begging it again with another video so in today's video i got a new wig that i will be trying to customize i've already washed it and let it air dry so now what we're going to do is do the you know that plucking stuff don't look at my cupboard you know that <laughs> plucking stuff and putting some thingies here so it blends in with the i don't know the technical term but y'all can come along with me on the right okay so this is the wig i got it's a 22 inch synthetic high temperature hair so i can straighten it and blow dry it and all of that but it is a synthetic wig after all so it will not last me more than a year but yeah <laughs> let's get into this video so i show you guys what i do to make my wigs look just a little just a little less wiggy like obviously it'll look like a wig because it's a wig but like that's so what i do to make it look just a little 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 Let's wiki, so let's get into this you video. You can see me because I'm using my tripod over here as my wig stand, so I have to put you guys here. But this is not my first try with synthetic wigs. So I have this bob wig that you guys saw me um, doing hairstyles with in my previous video. I hope it's my previous video, like I'm kind of confused, but yeah. So it's not the first time with it, but this is exactly what I did to this wig. And I want to try to do the same to that. See how it looks on my herd. On my head. a little poof because of my hair underneath and i washed it so i would like to straighten it so it's a little flatter but this is the hair on my head just <laughs> that looks like a wig oh my gosh i look like one of those aunts here yeah, that have hair on their head for the first time they're like yes oh darling no it's a wig <laughs> we know <laughs> we can see it's a wig but yeah it looks super poof right now and i don't i really don't like it but let's try fix it up to make it look less less like this <laughs> less like this. i mean you can't even see the part can you guys see the part there's a parting somewhere here there but like it's so tiny that ain't nobody can see that i don't even know if i can pluck it from there because the lace that they put is also quite tiny so let's try this out i'm gonna uh straighten it first i'm gonna put some heat protect i don't know if you put heat protect on synthetic hair hmm but I'm just gonna put heat protect anyway. Yo, focus on me. So, as I was saying, um, I'm going to put some heat protect on it and then I'm going to straighten the hair. I'm not really sure if you're supposed to put like things like heat protect on synthetic hair, synthetic high temperature hair, but let's see if it doesn't shrivel up and, and fall off. Wow, the Afri True Heat Protect. I got this from Clicks. I don't think it's more than 30 Rand. didn't break off and i've just straightened it so now i'm just gonna try and make the center parting a little bigger without showing the track so the other track as you can see this center parting here is very very tiny like here's the track immediately there's the track there's a few hairs as well as that side there's the track so i don't want to make it look 
bold and show the tracks but i just need to you know open it up some more because it's a little tight over there it's a little tight over there but like yeah some more yeah the hair is just gonna <laughs> look dead but yeah so i've done that i've opened it up a bit i don't know if it looks better to you guys but like the line is just a little more visible i can't do much more i would have loved to do much more but i truly can't because there's not enough um lace there's not enough lace so yeah so what i want to do now is cut some baby hairs and not make it as uh, long in front, like trim it just a little bit. I'm going to use a razor. I'm looking at the wrong side. Wow, the whole time I've been looking at the wrong side. Anyway, I'm going to use a razor to do that so it's not like a blunt cut and you know, it's got like layers, you know, layers. <laughs> control just because I feel like when hair is plastic it just like flies <laughs> so you can see it you can tell that yo yo her so I just like to spray it like a little bit of fist control so that it's not static you know it's not like eh, standing out there looking a whole mess so this is the fist control that I use yeah I would like to put some a bit of foundation by the hairline thingy so it matches me so i took a foundation that matches my complexion well it kind of doesn't match my complexion but like it kind of matches my complexion so because this is not lace all the way through i'm not quite sure how to put it but i'm just gonna put it on the underneath and like a tiny bit on the lace i don't want to get the hair to look you know brown but like <laughs> yeah so dirty anyway gonna get my beauty blender take a bit take a bit of that take it and then inside can you see what I mean so inside it's um, what's used to make the, the the head thing basically and not the lace but let's see if this works if I make this thing brown <music>
of me customizing my wig and making it more to my style and the way I like it. Thank you guys for watching my video. Any video suggestions, any video requests, anything you'd like to see, please do leave it in the comments down below and I will be sure to do it for you guys. Thank you for watching my videos. Bye loves.